Hello, everybody. We are over here at 3500 19th Street. Our listing agent, Massimo, says hello. What are we seeing today? We are seeing a top floor, Ooh. two bedroom, two Ooh. and a half bath condominium, mm -hmm. right around 1500 square feet with parking in the garage here, Tesla charger, Ooh. in the famed Mission Dolores neighborhood, two blocks to Dolores Park. Oh, yeah. I love this one. Thank you, Massimo. We're going to go in. It's number 306, 306. right? So we will take you up the stairs, even though there is the elevator. You've probably seen our videos here before. It's a great building that I remember this was just a parking lot long ago and the developer uh, helped you who built this, did a great job and also worked with Vanguard to sell the properties originally. And one of the great features here is this lovely courtyard. Wow, I haven't seen this. I remember these were little trees. The poplars are pretty spectacular. So we're gonna go through, we're gonna go through the outdoor stair, which is this giant metal mesh thing, which is great. Um, super serene, super great neighborhood. You've got a nice secluded ceiling area here. Look how pretty that is. So let's go up. I love this metal mesh. It's super, I don't know, cool. Um, you get a lot of light through but it's really safe, secure, and look, they can do that really cool form where you're floating in space. Now these units all vary, but they are really beautifully done. Great finishes, nice and bright, modern building, and it's been well cared for. Take a look over right here. There's Park Hill, Mission Dolores, backside of Twin Peaks. Now let's go over here. Three oh six. So, elevators over there. Stairs. If we kept going, would be there. Three oh seven. Just sold not too long ago. Three oh six. So this is a penthouse unit. Two levels. When you first come in, you'll notice the nice finishes. You've got the updoor, upstairs up space. Let's go in here. First bedroom. It is ensuite, which is really nice. You've got your heated floors here. You've got a nice floating vanity, actually nice and low. Vessel sink here, cool, uh, great tile, nice deep soaking tub. Oh, I like that little detail too, with the uh, glass up there that's private. Over here, this has got a lovely view towards the courtyard. Hello, hello. And then you got your entry closet here. This is your second bedroom much bigger wow great walk-in closet here that's a great big walk-in closet you can see it's very modern bright radiant heat i don't know i'm not sure if radiant heat oh you've got your heater here i can't remember which one it is great view that's bernal hill over there backside of liberty hill you can see wow you can see a lot actually and you're right above this intersection now over the weekends they close Valencia shooting off. And of course, there's a new, at least provisional Valencia bicycle lane in the middle, which, you know, it's good and bad. I've tried it and it's okay, but it is a little weird getting on and off of it. Floating vanity here. One of the things I remembered that I really liked about the finishes here is the solid acrylic vanity countertops. See, it's integrated in. You've got the floating part here. You've got the under cabinet lighting, big drawers as well with Bafu cabinets, the Germans. Curbless shower that walks into a linear, linear drain. Rain shower head, shower head here. You've got the hand, uh, hell of a thing here. And you've got your nice toilet back there. Because you're tall uh, and modern, you have a sprinkler, sprinkler. And if you wanted to do a feature light, you could. Great hardware as well. Let's see who did this hardware. Ooh, it's Volley and Volley. Great polished chrome. So Volley Volley is a great hardware uh, manufacturer. I love these stairs. Nice runner in the middle. Nice stainless steel going up here. Beautiful oak floors. Wow, take a look at that. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, look at that. Yeah, I like it, right? So you've got two decks. Number one is out here. Love the, teak, the, the, the wood down here. It's been oiled. You've got big views out this way. 
Wow, look at that. Doors Park is just right there, as you can see. Again, more of the big views. Wow, you are really quite central. <laughs> nice private area here. Going through here, beautiful built-ins as well. You've got your fireplace, nice built-in or mounted TV here. Look at that view up towards Cathedral Hill even. And in here, nice screen door. Let me see if I can be smarter than the screen door. And you've got your second balcony here. More Dolores backside of Castro. There's Corona Heights and Mission Dolores backside of Twin Peaks. The Mission, Bernal, and Potrero. Really pretty fantastic. You are right here. And let's go back in here where I think there was the other unit that was on the market uh, that sold, like we said, next door. I think this one feels more spacious up here. It's bigger, it's breezier. And you've got just a different utilization of space, but you've got big views. There's the Mint, Cathedral Hill, like we said. There's a staircase that we were going up. And over here, you've got your kitchen. I quite like this. It's a thin form uh, quartzite or porcelain, I think. But they did it where you have this, and you've got this bevel. That's a slow bevel. And you've got this metal channel that goes throughout here. I think we did this in the kitchen. I think this is where I got that idea from. Stainless steel top here which is a boppy again. You've got your wine cooler, your speed, Gagano microwave thing. Is it Gagano? Let's see, I think it is. I eh, can't quite tell, but I think it is. I like that here. You've got the seat area here. And over here, you've got your melee, and you've got your melee. I presume it's induction, yep, induction. Again, with that beautiful wrapping back here, even up here, look at the detailing. It went in and around, around the, uh, the windowsill here. Great here, you've got your, oh, that is a substantial air switch. And you've got your nice cabinetry here and your hood. And just really well done with the lighting here. Nice storage, really fantastic. And yes, here's the refrigerator, the melee as well, built-in, integrated, seamless washer and dryer with the Bosch. And this is what I remember. Look at this bathroom. So this bathroom is pretty neat in my opinion, where you've got the glass penny tile up here. Oh, it's a cute little mirror. And you've got this acrylic podium sink. It's a boffy as well. I remember this. I remember these when they first came out, how much I love these because it is just massive. Then you've got your Durbit floating toilet there and just a big sense of light with that skylight. That's pretty extraordinary. Um, nice built-in as well here. Really just a cool overall feel. You've got your speakers up here and you've got your recessed lights and you could do a pendant light up there if you wanted to. And yeah, really just, and more speakers up there. Really just well done, well executed. Look at this piece here. It's just really neat too. So unit 306, listed with our friends Massimo and Frank at Vanguard Properties. Beautiful, well-preserved, well-presented. Oh, we've got all your uh, remote entry here, lots of light switches, and I think there's more. I'm not sure what those are for, but uh, yeah, really just really well done and well executed. The building's been taken care of, obviously, and um, the details are pretty exacting, and the location is very central and uh, fun as well. Anyways, well, that's Kevin Ho. Thank you all for watching. Uh, be sure to tune in, like, subscribe, and we will see you at the next one. Until then, take care.